welcome back to my channel. So today I'm filming a weekend alive type of video. I get sometimes questions about like what I do in my free time, what I do for fun, what I do on the weekends. I filmed a few like day in the life and weekend alive type of videos before so you guys know what my work day usually looks like. So it should be a fun weekend this time. I think every weekend is different. Some weekends I, you know, mostly just stay at home or I do some YouTube scripting and editing and I prepare for videos. But uh, this time I do have some plans which are quite exciting. So tomorrow I have a tennis session uh, quite early in the morning. It will be my first official tennis session, so I'm kind of nervous but excited for it. Then I'm meeting a friend for lunch and then I'm meeting another friend in the afternoon as well. So this friend of mine just moved to London. She's one of my best friends from university, so I'm really happy that she's here now. She got a new job as a software engineer as well. Her background is also mechanical engineering, but she kind of taught herself how to code, but she does work in a different type of industry, more in like autonomous driving technology. And then I also have some YouTube stuff to do, so yeah, you'll get to see a bit of everything. But yeah, it's still Friday, it's not the weekend yet, and I do need to get back to work, so let's go. So I just finished my morning journaling for today. Uh, if you watched my morning routine video, you might have seen this notebook over there. It's a new journaling technique that I've been trying. I've been doing it now for two weeks. I like it so far, but I'll give you guys a proper update in a future video about that. Uh, regarding work, uh, just to give you some context and like an idea of what I'm doing today. Also, if you're new to the channel, I'm a software engineer based in London. So I started a new project at work now and I'm mostly working on that today. However, I'm still in the scoping phase, so I'm still trying to figure out the requirements of an existing system that's quite similar to the one that I'm working on now. However, um, in terms of requirements and scale, we're not exactly sure if the system can meet our needs. So we are evaluating that and trying to understand if we have to build our own version of it or if we can integrate it into the existing one. So this is the type of work that I'm doing right now. Um, there's quite a lot of uh, unknowns and a lot of ambiguity at this point which is not always easy to deal with, but it's something that we deal with a lot in software engineering, at least from my experience. And this is also sometimes perhaps one of the most challenging parts, I think, because it's, it's a very crucial part of any project. And you really need to do a lot of research and try to answer a lot of questions, which um, are not that straightforward to answer at this point. So that's what I'll be working on today mostly. And besides that, I'm also working on a few open things from my previous project. So a little update, it's currently 1 p.m. and I think I'm gonna take a lunch break and I might just go outside and grab a sandwich or something for lunch because I don't have any groceries. I need to order food. I don't have anything left. I think I have like an egg or something. So let's go outside and let's get some food. today and I want to go to the gym and do a workout. I have a gym in the building that I moved into recently. I'm quite ashamed to say that despite having a gym in the building I haven't been working out at all but I'm gonna go and I'm gonna work out now and it's gonna be painful and I have to wake up at 6 45 tomorrow for my tennis session and it's all gonna be too much and too painful. I know it already but I'm still gonna do it because I'm stupid. I can't be lazy. I need to work out. I need to prioritize it. One day I want to be a MILF. I want to be like a hot mom. Let's go. But first I need to take care of some laundry. ready to work out but I was feeling hungry so 
and made myself some porridge. in the video so I can take a moment to thank Brilliant for sponsoring a portion of this video. So in case you guys don't know Brilliant yet, Brilliant is a great platform where we can learn STEM interactively online. It has a wide range of courses ranging from statistics to computer science to maths and algebra etc. The courses are super engaging and interactive and they're really designed to make us understand the fundamentals and the core principles behind the topics and not just memorize formulas. I'm sure you know that our brain kind of works like a muscle so it's important for us to keep stimulating it and I think that that's where Brilliant is really good at. So the other day I had this idea for a video, I thought I would try to do the maths exam that I had to do uh, eight or nine years ago to apply to uni and see if I would still pass this exam. So spoiler alert, I started trying to do this exam and I'm not so sure if I would have passed. Not gonna lie, that kind of hurt my ego a bit, so after that happened a few weeks ago I started doing the Brilliant Maths course while I was commuting. I did the logic course before and just like the logic course, the math course also has a lot of like super engaging exercises which are really good uh, to kind of, you know, bring back all the skills and all the concepts from back then. I'm doing this course to mitigate the risk of embarrassing myself in case I do decide to film that video. So if like me you want to fine tune your STEM skills, you can start for free at brilliant.org slash csjackie or click the link in the description and the first 200 of you will get 20% off the premium annual subscription. After tennis I went for some brunch and then I went back home and <laughs> I had a little nap because I was just feeling so tired. Uh, now I'm gonna go outside again and meet my friend. So I'm just gonna meet her at her house and then we're gonna go to a park and just like chill. Let's go! Como é que vamos? Vamos lá fora. À piscina. Parece que vai dar um trambolico. Eu vou aqui das escadas abaixo. Primeiro não gosto nada. 
Es ve así, hermana. Es ve así, es ve así. Y les nos va de casual. Então o que é que fizeste? É uma pasta com camerão, uma pasta. Uma pasta com camerão, uh -huh. pancheta, uh -huh. tomate cherry, uh -huh. uh, queijinho, um bocadinho de cogumelos e com um molho de natas e tomate. Yay! Está bom. Está bom. Bastante bom aspecto. One quick update, it's Sunday evening. I woke up feeling extremely sick. The initial plan for today, for Sunday, was to do a chill day at home where I do some live admin and then I wanted to start going through this book, uh, Clean Architecture, and clean my flat a bit, but I woke up feeling so sick. This is my sick girl nightstand. Anyway, so yeah, this day didn't go according to plan, so I didn't film anything. I'm sorry about that. Also, excuse me, I look like shit. But regardless, I hope you enjoyed the video. And yeah, I will see you in my next one. Bye!